So the Vintage at the Art origin story began with actually the story of adopting our daughter. We were in need of funds to make that happen. And so our community and our family came together and created an event for us to sell items that they were donating to raise funds. And that turned into uh, about a year of selling items and raising money. We ended up with a lot of stuff. We needed to have um, a way to sell. And so we came up with the idea of starting an event where multiple vendors came together. We found an, uh, a venue that we loved and we started with 10 vendors. We were able to basically take items that people were discarding, turn them into something beautiful, kind of a beauty from ashes concept, and turn it into a small business that has just continued to grow through the years. So our family is a very vital part of our business. Um, Vintage at the Yard couldn't run without our family's involvement. They they do everything from taking money at the gate and greeting our customers, to helping set up our vendors the day before and the day of, to setting up our booth, helping with marketing, um, parking our cars, uh, everything. Even our, our son, Levi, has been with us since he was six years old, selling Beanie Babies at his own little sale table. So uh, it's pretty crucial. During COVID, we had to make a hard decision because our business was um, moving along very well and things were gaining momentum and our crowds were growing, our vendors were excited, but we realized that for the safety of our customers and our vendors, we needed to make the hard decision to shut it down. Once it became safe again to do so, we were excited to see the crowds return. They were excited to come back and be a part of our community again and shop great vintage treasure. I'm really excited about the future of Vintage at the Yard moving forward because while it will still be a family-run business and we will all still be there as vendors, my son Christian is going to be taking over in charge of uh, running the event and it's going to be even more fabulous. He's got a lot of great plans for it and it's, it's very exciting to see the ways that he's going to make it even better. I'm really excited to bring my skill set to Vintage at the Yard because it's an event series that people love but it takes a lot of behind the scenes work to make it a fun and a safe experience for everybody. Uh, it's so worth it when we get to do all of that work and then see it come together and see people really just enjoying their time at the event. Uh, so if you are a vintage or a vintage inspired vendor, we'd love to work with you. We hope you'll consider working with us. If you like supporting small local businesses or are just looking for something fun to do on a Saturday, we'd love to have you bring your family to spend time with our family. Uh, and we hope to see you at Vintage at the Yard.